on this video and if you're new to our channel click that subscribe button ring that notification bell so you get updates anytime I upload new videos now before we get into the video a couple of things I want to mention first of all I want to thank all of my subscribers old and new you guys are awesome I appreciate all of the comments and everything that you guys have been doing you've been sharing my videos following me on Instagram and everything and for that I love 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 thank you guys for all of the support also guys lol surprise omg series three that is all the buzz that's all we're talking about um over the last several weeks um all of the dolls have been shown but they finally came out with chillax guys and showed us what she looks like and i think she is adorbs i love her anyway in the comments below you guys let me know of the lol surprise omg series three dolls which one is your favorite but without any further delay let's go ahead and get to these 12 looks this is dazzle guys she looks so cute now this is my sleigh necklace but this one was like a dud guys this is how it came out of the box so i didn't actually do this i have ruined some lol surprise stuff but this i will not take credit for it so anyway she has on neon licious is a little beret and i gave her a little box of girls little bow um this is just a little yellow bow that i put on top um you could take it off leave it on whatever it just, you know, I thought it was a cute little look to tie the colors in together, but it's definitely not required. This is actually a bow that belongs to one of my LOL Surprise dolls. You know, the kind that like wraps around their head. I thought it looked cute on her shoulder, so I gave it to her. The little top is actually from one of my Bratzilla Switch a Witch outfits. I actually think I got three Switch a Witch dolls. They don't make them anymore. They're from like way back in the day, but you might be able to find them on eBay. They're totally, totally cool, the dolls themselves, but you can use some of the clothing and accessories and stuff on your own Jeep dolls now this little skirt I'm gonna have to do like a little tutorial to tell you guys how I made it I actually made it from some fringe that I got at Joanne fabric and it's just fringe like you could use like on a pillow or you could use on other things and it already looks like this it's already pleated and everything and all you have to do is attach some velcro and you're in business and you got yourself a skirt so that's what I did uh, the little bracelet is all girls and then the boots are some boots that I got online I believe these are monster high boots but they're cute and so guys this is the look that I have for dazzle so this next look guys is Royal B and let me tell you a little bit about her outfit Royal B I actually made these glasses these were some boxy girl glasses I cut them in half I was really inspired by class Prez and the fact that her glasses aren't like full so I did that and I put a little bling on here so I made these from some glasses <laughs> that were boxy girls and this little necklace right here is a Barbie necklace and the little jumper like skirt is actually Neonlicious's but I turned it inside out only because the, there's like little um, silver studs on the front and since she had gold I thought that didn't really match very well so I didn't want to do that. Underneath you can barely see it but she has Uptown Girls little boy shorts undies on. Now the thing of this outfit that everyone seems to be commenting on are these leggings guys. Louis Vuitton nice 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 these I actually got on Etsy and I believe they came from Ukraine and you guys know in a previous video I'll insert a link above I've actually been to Ukraine a couple of times cool cool place and so I thought it was awesome that these leggings actually came from there Royal B has these boots guys a really really cute gold boots and so I think she looks amazing and so this is the look that I have for Royal B. So next up guys we have Snowlicious. Snowlicious has a really simple look 
But some cool things that I want to point out about her, um, she actually has on the glasses that belong to Downtown BB. And this little choker like top or whatever is something that I got online in a lot of items that I purchased. I believe it's Monster High. I can't say for certain, but that's what I believe. And I think it is so, so cute. Now the little dress, it actually is like a top and a bottom that I created. I made it from a balloon, guys. This is a balloon that I caught into a couple of pieces and did some things to it. And so <laughs> I think my new little fashions will be balloons. When you're looking for a little top to put underneath a little jacket or another little item, you can create it out of a balloon. If you're looking for a skirt, yep, get yourself a balloon. And you have so many different options, very inexpensive. And I think this is such an awesome look. And she has on these little boots that I purchased online in a whole bunch of doll items that I purchased, guys. But this is the look that I have for Snow Licious. So Speaster, guys, she looks amazing with all of her different colors and everything. I gave her kind of a faux look of a tie. Now this, well, first of all, she has on Uptown Girls little, like, undershirt or whatever you want to call it um, but I gave her like a little faux tie this is just some bling that I actually got it's like a piece of a hair barrette and I just kind of cut it this way I used some fashion tape to affix it to her actual uh, top and this little shirt or whatever you want to call it that you see right here has like a little train on it and stuff it's cute and it's a part of this little jacket I love it and she has on this little belt that I got in a bunch of doll clothes that I purchased now these pants guys are a part of the Disney Princess Comfy Squad so these jeans already look like they're cuffed which is so cute and she has on these gold little shoes she looks great and so guys this is the look that I have for Speedster so angles guys she has the most simple little changes but I think they're very cute on her um, she has on this pink little top that is awesome and instead of the long bell bottom pants in a previous video I told you guys that I actually cut them off here which I thought was a cute little look for a jumper love it and she's got on her signature boots which I think these ankle boots look really cute all the colors go quite well and I also gave her these little glasses that I got from a boxy girl set so I think that is cute and so this is the look that I have for angles so you guys know that I'm always styling my dolls with na 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 surprise hat and hair and it gave me an idea that with the actual hat that comes with Neonlicious we could probably do something similar and play with so many other different colors of hair so this is a pop pop hair surprise guys beautiful pink and blue look which looks amazing so I put this on my Neonlicious she has on a little monster high like belt and this little top right here came from one of my boxy girl sets and this little jean jacket is actually a Mickey Mouse jacket guys yes a mickey mouse jacket and i think it looked amazing on her you can even put these little glasses on i mean these boxy girl glasses to give her a different look but i think it's so cute and this is the look that i have for neon licious so up down girl looks so cute guys this i got in one of my pop pop hair surprises like the mega surprise or super surprise whatever it's called it was like super huge i got this bow and i put it in her hair and these glasses that she has on are Minnie Mouse glasses from a little set that you can get with Mickey and Minnie together. Um, it's like movie night out or something like that it's called. I made this little pearl necklace. Awesome little accessories that I got that you can kind of do your own thing with. And the dress is a Minnie Mouse dress guys. And if you look really, really closely, you will see little like Mickey Mouses like right there. So cute. And she has on these little pumps, these little purple pumps. And so guys, this is the look that I have for Uptown Girl. So All Girl is actually a gig today, guys. I actually put some tape on her um, little glasses. Maybe in a future video, I will give one of my dolls like a tie and a pocket protector so they will be completely geeked out. And so let me tell you, when I saw this little shirt, Geek Chic, it actually is from one of the Disney Princess Comfy Squad outfits. It's so cute. It's really hard to get a photo of it though because when I pose her on the actual doll stand it's really hard to see so sometimes you know it looks like the outfit doesn't fit well but it's because by the time I put it on a stand and put it on and then try to pose the doll it just looks crazy sometimes not always but sometimes but anyway so that one I didn't get the best photo but you guys I think this is such a cute look 
I love the little bow and everything, the glasses and all. And she has on these little strappy kind of shoes and I just put them on because they were yellow and black and I thought it looked good. But anyway guys, this is the look that I have for all girls. So guys, the 4th of July is coming and we've got swag guys. And let me tell you, I know the difference between a US flag and a UK flag. But still, I thought the fact that it was red and blue and white, I thought that would be cool to kind of pair them all together. And so that's the look that I gave her for today. So the first thing I wanna talk about is this little hat, guys. I actually got it at Joanne Fabric. It is a little pet hat that came with like a little beard. I cut the beard off. Um, it's supposed to be for like a little small dog, like a chihuahua or something. And obviously, this is not on a chihuahua. It's on my OMG doll. And so she also has on these glasses that belong to Miss Independence which are cute and this little necklace is actually something that belongs to one of my OMG like pets I believe I think it belonged on a pet or something but anyway I just cut the back of it so that I could actually fit it on her neck which I do sometimes when I find things that are a complete like circle but I think it'll look cute on my dolls I'll cut the back of it so that they can wear it like a choker or a necklace or something that's a little tip in terms of what I do now these are actually Snowlicious's pants and I turned them into shorts this I believe is a Barbie Barbie like swimsuit or something but I thought this was all cute and came together well and you guys know I have like a gazillion shoes and stuff for my dolls but I thought this was so cute with the blue and the red and stuff and went perfect and so also I did pair it with this little purse that is um, one of the purses that I got in one of my Lil's little outfits with one of my LOL surprise dolls and so I think this was so cute and so this is the look that I have for swag so I don't know if you guys know but I have like 300 dolls or something I have so many different dolls many I haven't unboxed and I had my little pony equestria girls I had some of the bigger dolls and I just happened to be looking at them I was organizing some stuff here in my doll room and let me tell you I thought mm, maybe some of this stuff would fit my OMG dolls and I was correct and the funny thing is the same time it is like the same day or the next day or something like that that I actually tried this one of my subscribers suggested this so if I can find her comment I will definitely give her a shout out below but anyway guys let me tell you I thought this fit so cute and this little skirt everything cute love the little bow tie and it fits great around her neck um, that you can put on there now these shoes are boxy girl shoes they're a little loose but I thought they had the kind of plain look that I was going for and so guys this is the look that I have for groovy babe so Dolly is here guys and she has on DJ's earrings she has on a little necklace from one of my OMG dolls and she also has on this switch of which is actually a skirt but I turned it into a top and she has on this little belt that belongs to Uptown Girl and this is like the Uptown Girl when you buy her in the single you get Miss Positive in black and white and I just had to get her again because I wanted this too also I messed up her stockings in the first one that I had and I lost her top long story anyway so I didn't need to get another one but I thought this was cute and I used this as the inspiration for the outfit the little pants that she has on is a Team Stacy, like legging pants or whatever. And the stripe on the side is cute. And this independent little boots with the gold and white. And so this is the look that I have for Dolly. So this is Busy BB, guys. And I think she looks amazing. She actually has on the little top that I made. It was from some more fringe that I purchased. In a future video, I'll show you guys how I actually turned that into this little top right here and then also she has on a little Barbie bracelet she has on a Han Couture little white top that I've used before some little edging that I used and created a belt because the little pants that she has on right here actually belong to the Disney Princess Comfy Squad but it's like really unfinished at the and so I needed to cover it up a little bit so that's why I did it like that the earrings that she has on belong to Neonlicious and these boots are Monster High boots that I actually purchased online. And to top her outfit off, and I have no idea who this belongs to, but she's got this little basket. And the outfit all together really, really, really reminds me of Dorothy from The Wizard of Oz. It really does. It gives me those kinds of vibes. So this is the look that I created for Busy BB. And so guys, that was my last look so far. So you guys let me know in the comments below which look was your favorite. But as always, I'm gonna let you guys know which one was mine. And so the look that I picked that was my favorite today, guys, was your girl right here, Snowlicious. 
I love this look because I think it's so simple like being able to turn it into like a take you can make tops or bottoms or whatever with balloons I think that is so cool to be able to do that I love this little look on her I think the red and the blue goes really really well and I love her little shoes and so this was definitely my favorite of the bunch. So you guys let me know what you think about this video. If you're new here, please subscribe to my channel. Every new subscriber definitely helps. So guys, that's all we had today on Instant Ride Play. But before we go, I just wanted to say, even if you have a hard day, we hope you find some time to play. And we'll see you next time on Instant Ride Play. That's what it's all about.